a very good morning to all of you by this time you have checked your result and you got your percentile score okay student i would like to emphasize that it's percentile score not your exact score okay and in this video we are going to unreveal all the misunderstanding okay and we will also try to understand what exactly is percentile score okay so the outline of this session would be like this first we will try to understand what exactly is percentile score why it is used and how is it calculated and we will try to see uh, the calculation with the help of an example okay so let's see the first question that what is a percentile score okay so student uh, this is a score based on the relative performance of the candidate who have appeared in a particular session on that particular day oh my god it's a long definition yeah so student just uh, think of that it is a relative performance with some other candidate who have appeared in that exam that's it okay so the the second thing that is related to percentile score that whatever the score original score the mark score which you have obtained in the exam out of 120 okay so it is uh, converted into scale ranging from 0 to 100 on that particular session on that particular day okay and one important thing uh, in which most of the students are confused is that it is not same as the percentage of marks score okay so if you are having percentile score of 78 it doesn't mean you have got 78 marks or 78 percent of 120 it doesn't mean the same okay drdo will release uh, your original marks after the exam hopefully okay so the next question that can come in your mind why is it used okay why is it used let us see so the very uh, first thing is that your exam was conducted in multiple days uh, i think from five days correct now five days and multiple session three shifts were there or four shifts were there yes and as you have seen in our video also the difficulty level for each session for each day is somewhat uh, different okay in the first day it was very uh, difficult to moderate whereas in the last session we have seen the easy difficulty level okay so there is uh, unequal uh, fairness in uh, this thing uh, for because of uh, multiple days and multiple session so to ensure the fairness in exam based on some normalization process is required okay so some normalization process that a particular organization generally follow they doesn't uh, disclose uh, this normalization process how they have con converted okay so this is the reason that to ensure the fairness uh, for multiple days multiple session and multiple difficulty level this percentile score this normalization process is being applied now the most important question that can come in your mind is how is it calculated student first of all uh, i would like to say that if you want to see the exact uh, calculation you have to uh, go to some uh, national te testing agency uh, or some uh, exam agency who is conducting the exam but drdo doesn't release its formulas okay so we are uh, telling you the common formula which is used by most of the exam agency so the formula is like this uh, that percentile score p1 is the number of candidates okay it is number of candidates having equal or less score than p1 in that session divided by total number of candidate appear in that session multiplied by 100 okay so again uh, percentile score is number of students number of candidates having less or equal marks than p1 in that session divided by total number of candidates appeared in that session multiplied by 100 okay this formula seem to be very uh, 
intuitive one let's see the uh, let understand with the example okay as i told you it depends upon the exam conducting agency so let's see the example suppose uh, you got your percentile score uh, as a 90 okay so there were uh, an exam of 500 5000 student and you got a percentile score of 99 okay so it doesn't mean you got 99 um, percent marks or 99 marks it means that 99 percent of students what is the 99 percent of student means 4950 students are below you okay whatever your rank is 4950 students are below you or in other words you can say you are at the 50th rank from the top okay understood i think this uh, example helps you to understand how percentile is calculated so student if somebody ask uh, can we convert our percentile score to original marks no so you need some information for that first is your uh, total number of candidates you should know okay then again as i told you you should know uh, the range of marks again for different session for different six and overall cutoff for each category that you should know so it is very uh, tedious and difficult to revert back calculate from the uh, percentile score to your cutoff marks okay so that's a student i hope i uh, give you some insight on uh, percentile score and student it's percentile score not your score okay thank you and have a nice day